Hey, Nick, I found another town. Oh, okay, I'll teleport to you then. Wait, is this the same town that we were in? Oh! Hey, what is going on, everyone? Welcome to the next episode of Pixmon and Catch Em All. So, Jordan, last episode, we did really good. Woo! We ended up catching Zamazenta, and I've updated my Pokedex with all the Pokemon you caught. And all together, Jordan, we have caught 42 Pokemon. That's 4% of the Pokemon Pokedex complete. That's so sweet, dude. We're moving and grooving. <laughs> Zubat. I see a Zubat, Jordan. I'm going to get a Zubat. That's not one either of us have caught. Even more importantly, dude, I just found an Inke. Ooh. That's probably surprisingly rare. I don't know if it's actually that rare, but we've not seen it, and it's certainly not especially common. Whenever I spot a Pokemon, dude, that oh, I probably don't have a lot of Pokeballs. Yeah, I don't. I have three Pokeballs left. I'm gonna grab this dude, then I'm gonna head back to town and see if I have things to sell just from the Pokemon I've been taking down. That works for me. I just sent out a level 70 Zamazenta against a Zubat. This poor thing. <laughs> <laughs> I really need a Pokemon with False Swipe. Luckily, the Zubat's so weak that I didn't catch it. Wait, what? Wait, yo, do you know if Zamazenta can learn it? Probably not. Maybe it can. I do not know. Okay, real quick, dude, what I'm gonna do, because it's now going to be morning. I'm gonna look and see if there's any Pokemon items, dude, in these chests. Because if there are, then your theory of them restocking would be right, and that would be really useful for me to get Pokeballs. Exactly. Also, I'm going to go ahead and teleport on over to you, because I, I kind of wanted to head back to Hello, friend. Bye-bye, friend. Yeah, did they restock at all? It's technically not the next day yet. Technically, you're right. All right, well, I'm going to go then to find just a normal shopkeeper. Probably Sally. Where are you, Sally? There you are. I also can give you some extra stuff. I'm actually still pretty rich. I mean, I sold five hyper potions, Jordan. Come on, man. I, I got the money right now. Where'd you get yourself them hyper potions? Dude, I am not entirely sure actually i legally will not say <laughs> i will buy you 45 pokeballs oh dude that means that i can get 45 pokemon of all goes well okay it's actually 42 that i just sent you but it is what it is jordan good enough quick balls i'm gonna buy some for the difficult pokemon lure balls are interesting but not necessary i do like heavy and dusk but i think i'm gonna go for great right now because that's enough for ma the majority of pokemon that we're going against right now you know and it's good bang for the buck. Exactly, yeah. So what I'm going to do, man, is I'm just going to, every Pokemon I catch, I'm going to put in a different box so that I can quickly update you on what I have, right? Mm-hmm. Then, dude, what I'm going to do is later, I will actually try to evolve everything because that would be a rapid way to expedite the Pokedex, but it's not something that I have to do immediately. Yeah, I'm kind of evolving my Pokemon very quickly right now by battling this trainer level 50 with my Zamazenta level 90. Boom. Just because I kind of felt like it kind of sounded fun you know, can you blame me? I was kind of being a little wild and a little wacky. Jordan, do you want to battle maybe? You? No. Yeah, why not? Because there's nothing that we get from that. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, man? Other than pain, tears, and anger. I feel like I get at least a little bit joy from demolishing you. Yeah, but that's despicable. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Wait, but I'm getting money from beating this guy. Although not too much, I am getting a Rookie D evolving right now. So is that like 45 Pokemon overall now? Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all, dude. Especially because we're not only knocking out, dude, just the normal staples that everyone would expect us to get. We're getting way more, dude. We're going above and beyond right now. Like vanilla. Exactly. And that's a piece of ice cream. I'd normally just eat it, but this time, catching it. But we're moving up in the world. You give a man an ice cream, he eats it for a day. Tell a man to collect it, and he might not eat that day. What would a man do if you went up to him and said, hey, can you collect some ice cream? I don't know. Don't eat it, just collect it. Collect what would they it. do? I would not know how to react to that. I don't know, dude. Would he ask, maybe he would ask, can I have a freezer? Hmm? I, I don't know, but I am curious. Would ice cream dude keep better in the freezer or would it be better to keep it out of the freezer and then refreeze it at a later date after it melts? What in the world are you even trying to talk about? Bro, I'm gonna buy a bunch of jars and I'm gonna buy all the ice cream. I'm gonna let it melt and put it in a jar and then I'm gonna label those jars. I'm gonna put it in a freezer and then I'm gonna leave that in a storage unit somewhere and see what happens. I'm so incredibly confused by all of your actions and words. You should never ask me premises for things though if you don't expect me to give you a real answer. <laughs> I don't think that is a real answer. I think that's a crazy answer. Well, that might be true too, but it is the truth. Yo, did you get a ice cream yet? Yep, and a Bergmite. Well done, my dude, because that's everything I'm seeing right now. Yeah, so you're just running around doing nothing? No, I was catching, I caught a swine up. That was the first Pokemon I caught, Jordan, <laughs> and we, we even talked about that last episode, which we had just recorded. Wait, wait, 
Jordan. Oh wait, it's a den. I thought it was an Articuno Shrine initially, but dens are also going to be really good even though it's hard to catch Pokemon from them. Jordan, we can get a Galarian Mr. Mime right now. Get over here, dude. Yo, you got yourself some Pumpity Pumpkins? Excuse you? Well, you can, you can make M Mr. Rhymes appear with pumpkins. Oh, dude, I completely forgot about that actually. We should also do that. We need to get a shovel right now. So what you can do guys is you can pop a jack-o-lantern on top of something here. I'm coming on over. Yeah, you're here not to help with the fight, no. but just make it where you can maybe catch the Pokemon also. Exactly, exactly. Because I'm definitely gonna die here. I'll try to put it to sleep if I can. Oh wait, is this thing fairy? I forgot. Oh! No, it is psychic. Oh wait, you sent- Oh, yours is Zamazenta. Yeah, for a second I thought you sent out Jolteon. Yes, I have a Zamazenta. It's just in a weird order right now. We're on the right side this time. Yeah, dude, it's crazy talk. This guy looks funny. What's he up to in there? What's he thinking? I don't know, but Mr. Mime should be, uh, Dunzo. Yeah. Oh, wait. Is this bugged? Will it work? It's bugged and it doesn't work. Fantastic. Oh, dude, come on. Wait, I did get a wishing piece. That's actually really cool. We can use that later when it's not bugged. I got some experience candy. I At least we get the items from it, but that's that's trash. Yeah, speaking of bugs, by the way, have we gotten a Letty Bug yet? I tried getting one at one point, but then I think it got away from me. Are you good to chase that one? You see it, right? <laughs> Yeah! Did you see that, dude? Did you see that? Nope. I dove, dude, off the mountain and got into a fight with it. It was my one shot. Good stuff, man. Keep up the mediocre work. I am disappointed that you said that. It was actually one of the more incredible things that you would see. Well, yeah, but I'm just not trying to put too much pressure on you. That's all. Do you have the medal to give to me? What? What? When I do well, you said that you would give me a gold medal. I really don't remember saying that. I actually, in fact, remember not saying that. In that case, Christmas is coming up. <laughs> you want a gold medal? For my performance, of course. Uh, can I give you a different metal? Only if it has equivalent monetary value. <laughs> <laughs> to how much gold? <laughs> I don't know. Hey, Nick, I found another town. For, quit talking about your weird, your weird side story. Okay, I'll teleport to you then. I'm getting a bunch of stuff from here, dude. Oh, we can catch the Golurk here. Wait, is this the same town that we were in? Oh, I was actually in a spot I wanted to be, and then I teleport back to you because I thought it was a new town, but it was actually the same town. <laughs> it's because, dude, there was a chest that you hadn't gotten. I just got a bunch of Pokeballs from it. We know that they can restock, potentially. But nothing else restocks, just that one chest. It might be based on time, and it may have been the first chest we opened. Where did the Golurk go here, by the way? Wasn't there one? No. Why not? Maybe you should run back to where you TP from. <laughs> I'm angry. <laughs> I got buckets. You getting a bucket crashes me? How is that a thing? My entire Wait, game crashed. You crashed? Let's go. All right. That's not a let's go moment. <laughs> oh, dearling. That's one Pokemon Ooh. we haven't seen yet. And Stunky. Go get the Stunky, dude. Get the Stunky. Ooh, I TP. Oh, I see it. I don't have to TP to you. I'm on my way, Stunky. I can smell it from here, Nick. Good. What does it smell like? Well... I had to tell you this, Nick. It seems like it's trying to mimic a skunk. Why? I know. Dude, I'll be honest. I've smelled so many skunks in my life. Why? That it doesn't bother me in the slightest. How? What? I don't know. I'm just used to it. It doesn't gross me out. Like, if a smell grosses me out, like, anything that's really gross is horrible. But, like, skunk? I don't know. Skunk doesn't really gross me out. I'm so used to it. It is what it is, man. You should... Well, dude, you seem like you're in the rare population of people that should own a skunk as a pet. You should bring it into your home. Well, Jordan, getting sprayed can be really bad, actually, though. Well, you can de-stinkify them, though. Do you know what's worse? What? Rabies. Well, <laughs> that's another shot you can give them, Jordan. Oh, good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Exactly. I don't think my dogs would like the skunk or my dogs would like the skunk too much. Yeah, I think they would love the skunk. They'd be like, this dude smells awesome. <laughs> so maybe wait until the stunky evolves into skunk tank. Exactly. And then, wait, no, because then he's a tank and you have to get a permit to own one of those, I think. Oh, I already have that permit. Oh, really? When can I drive in your tank? Never. You need to get the permit and you're blacklisted from getting that. Am I really? Yeah. Can I apply to get unblacklisted from the permit of tanking? Not after what I told the FBI. Did you lie or did you tell them the truth? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, you're in. There's a lot of Pokemon spawning that's worth catching. Like, yeah, Fungus? Man. You haven't caught Fungus, or have you? I have not. I've caught the Inke. Okay, we need to get a couple Wurmples as well. I'm trying to get Zubat. That will be five Pokemon taken care of like that, man. It'll be fantastic. Moving and grooving. Is five the right number? Yes, because the middle evolution is different as well. Fantastic. Wait, did you catch a Hoot Hoot yet? No, I've not. That was one of the ones that was on the list. So you can go ahead and do that, Jordan. I'm catching Hoot Hoot. I like saying Hoot Hoot. Ooh. 
Ooh, I want the worm pull, but there's a belly bolt, and I am going to prioritize that. Bro, be careful. Belly bolt shoots a lightning from its belly. Does it really? It does. That's what they tell everyone about it. It does have a radiation symbol on its back, and that's the first time I've noticed that. Does it actually? Yeah. I've never seen that. Is that legit or is that a Pixelmon exclusive? Not exclusive. I think that's just how it looks. I'm starting to think, too, that that's a radioactive frog. <laughs> Yo, to be fair, it kind of looks like one, you know? I right, mean, you do that. I'm going to catch Skitty because uh, it only spawns in the fall, and so if this series goes to summer, we'll never be able to catch it. Jordan, do you know what season comes after fall? I do not. <laughs> <laughs> because it's not summer next, Jordan. Yeah, it's winter next, and so we'll never be able to catch it. Yeah, good one, Jordan. Do you know what comes after winter? I do not. It's one out of two. Don't say fall. Uh, autumn? You're a bad person. <laughs> How am I a bad person? You're factually a bad person. <laughs> no, I'm factually accurate. It's definitely... I've lost all the warm pulls. Can you teleport to me if you're not in battle? As soon as I catch this skitty, I will teleport to you. Okay, well, that means you are in battle. Or are you throwing Pokeballs out of battle? No, I'm getting in battle. Okay, good. Because otherwise I'd be like, that's why you're wasting all your Pokeballs. Guess what level it was. Guess what level it was. Guess what level it was. 200. Two. You were close. Yo, I was actually close. And it took you that long to catch? Hey. I mean, it's level two. Ooh, Ariados. I haven't even found Ooh. a spinner rack yet, but I will catch this. Bro, somebody needs to do a fusion of that with Gyarados, and it could be Gyarados. <laughs> okay, Jordan, good one. Dude, it would be a spider serpent. <gasps> How is I that not a Pokemon? You catch this? No, that actually does sound kind of cool. But Dude. there's Drapion, which is kind of similar, because when you think about it... Wait, scorpions are arachnids, aren't they? Am I wrong? No, I think you're wrong. Yes, I am wrong, because they have... Wait, how many legs do they have? It, it probably depends on the scorp. Just six, right? Nicholas, can I be honest with you? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, I have no idea right now, Druid. I'll be honest. I, I, I choose not to hang out with scorpions because I don't want them to hurt me. Yeah, I, I don't really like scorpions either. They they can be dangerous. Nah. <laughs> oh, I got Ariados and Premier Ball. We still will need a spinner rack, though. And we need Wurmples, and the Wurmples are gone. But you know what? I don't think it'll be too hard for us to track down a Wurmple if we're absolutely needing to track down a Wurmple. I think that if we're unable to catch Wurmple, we deserve to never play Pixelmon ever again. True! Hey, you should teleport to me, by the way, because Pokemon spawn faster when we're together. And I'm up high up in an area. I'm pretty close to you, dude, but right now I'm catching Eradicate, because why would you waste time leveling up your Rattata when I can just catch Eradicate? Mm -hmm. Depends on how long it takes you to catch the Eradicate, I'd say. Seven more seconds. That's the max. Okay, seven, six, five, four, and four three, rolls. Easy. Two. You actually got it. Nice. I had no faith in you at all. Don't worry, guys. He has no idea I'm lying. Oh, he is lying, isn't he? Nobody comment down below. Oh yeah, I see Eradicate on the map. <laughs> <laughs> you're you're the one who thinks that uh, the scorpions are spiders. You're spreading misinformation on the internet. I didn't spread misinformation. I was saying, are they or are they not? Because I don't know, but I feel like it might be. <laughs> all right, I'll look it up. Give me a second. I threw a Pokeball. It'll catch Thank it. you. I'm pretty sure I'm wrong. Is scorpion an arachnid? All right, hey Nick. Yeah. They are? Yeah, they got eight legs like mites and ticks. Gross. Yo, let's go! I called it. I knew it. Oh, and I'm looking at it. They do, and then they also have a tail. Crazy. It's crazy, man. Imagine if spiders had a tail. Bro, that would be wild. Then they'd have nine legs. Wait, no, they'd have a tail. Forget I said anything. Bro, imagine if you had a pet scorpion and you named it Bunny. So you could tell everybody that you had a pet bunny. But well, really, you knew that it was a scorpion. Hey, Nick, you want to come see my pet bunny? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> it's really cute. Oh, but I do want to catch this basket. Whoa, oh, sorry. I totally forgot that I had the power of, of ice. Ah, it's Sometimes. Where is Basculin? Uh, there she blows. Here it is. Go, Sandy Gas, use hypnosis. Ahoy, sailor. Uh, ahoy. Oh, hey, look, I made a little hole for you, dude. Uh, thanks, but no real thanks, man. How is it no real thing? Dude, you're not even grateful. Oh, no. It actually took me down before I put it back to sleep. I didn't expect that. Why? Because, Jordan, you see, it is fighting for its life because it doesn't realize that I'm not trying to take its life. I'm just trying to catch and put in my uh, PC forever. Yeah. And ever. And ever. And ever. A delightful existence. Did you catch yourself a uh, Zubato yet? Yes. Did you really? Yeah, Jordan, I, we, yeah, we, we, come on, we're both catching a lot of Pokemon, right? We're, we're both catching Pokemon, right? Yeah, we're both catching Pokemon. But see, I always assume that you would be afraid of Zubat based on your massive fear of Zubats. I like bats. Yeah, but Zubats? Yeah. Yeah. They're spooky. How? They, they go, hey, they shriek at you and stuff. I thought they just shrieked at, you know, people that can't own tanks. Wait, look, my eyes stayed, dude. <laughs> it did. Yeah? 
it stayed this time. It might be whether or not you're in a cold area, which we're not in cold area, but maybe the nighttime matters. Maybe my powers are growing. <laughs> no, no. Have you? You haven't gotten a Caterpie, have you? Of course not, dude. I'm not playing that version. Have we gone this long without getting a Caterpie? Is this the version of the game that has Caterpie in it? Yes. W which one is the one that doesn't, Jordan? Pokemon Yellow. Do you have a Goldeen yet? Did you say Gallade? No, I said Pokemon Yellow. Have I caught what? Oh, Goldeen, Goldeen. I've not caught a Goldeen. Go ahead and get yourself a Goldeen, Jordan. I will get There's it. There's the gold you wanted. I like that, dude. There's not a Pokemon named Sea Queen, even though Goldeen is essentially trying to be that, you know? And then it becomes a Sea King. Ain't that crazy? Yo, that's crazy, man. I never thought about it that way. Or I'm gonna call it next game. They're gonna have Sea Queen, dude. <laughs> I don't think they will. They do have Vespa Quinn. She gonna be queen of the sea. She evolves from Goldeen and Sea King's gonna- Oh, all my ice is disappearing! Oh. Who would've thought? It is daytime now, Jordan. It is sunrise. Maybe that is how it works? I don't know, man. All I know is I keep circling back to the same area and I'm just about done being in the area because I can do slash check spawns, which I forgot about. Ooh. And what Pokemon have we not gotten here? Bell Bellsprout. Bellsprout's Bell actually Bellsprout. not even Bellsprout. rare, and we haven't found that. That's absurdly common. Also, yo, dude, I have a Ivy Sword now. Oh, congrats. How does that make you feel? Bro, it makes me feel special, like a special boy. <laughs> Good stuff. Why do you ask me questions if you don't want to know the answers? Yeah, I really didn't want to know any of your answers, I guess. What's the question that you might actually want to know from me? Well, it was, you know, whether or not scorpions were spiders or not, but we already found out that, well, they're not spiders, but they're arachnids. <laughs> Yes, they're arachnophobia. Dude, I want to know, if I had eight arms, would I become an arachnid? Ooh, I don't know. Don't think that's how it works. I think there have to be some more features. Because I don't think I'm too much of a spider-looking fella. Well, how confident are you? Pretty confident. I don't think anyone would look at me and be like, Man, that guy kind of looks like a s spider. <laughs> you catching a Teddy Ursa, by the way? Yeah, I am. Nice. I used my brain power to think of that. Did you see me fighting a Teddy Ursa and you went, he's probably not going to kill it. Did, did you kill it? No, no, I'm catching it. Oh, dude, you know what you did kill accidentally, but is back? This flow? Whooper. Oh, Whooper. Hey, yo, get a Whooper, dude, before I kill it. Yeah, that's the goal, Jordan. That is the goal. There's also a lot of ocean Pokemon here, and I think it's about time we just go ahead and try getting them. Yeah, dude, I think if you see them, you might as well go for it. Also, this Teddy Ursa is impossible to catch. It might have a higher catch rate. I want to say it actually does. It's kind of bonkers. I'm gonna actually have to send out, dude, a Ledyba to damage it because I mean I'm putting it to sleep and it's level five, dude. But it's not like staying in a Pokeball. <laughs> it's level five. It's level five, dude. Caterpie's evolving. Hey, dude, it's not even a cat, though. No, it's also not a pea. A pie. Pie. It's pronounced pie, Nick. Well, it's not either of the two. That's true, dude. That would be a weird bug. It would be fairy, dude, if it were part pie. I like that all the fairy Pokemon, they're like, we're going to make them pastry Pokemon. We're going to make them yummy. If they're delicious, they're a fairy. <laughs> Yeah, that's how they do it. And I'm like, all right, Nintendo. Bro, what's the next one? What what confectionary delight do they not have in the game yet? Do they have a pizza Pokemon, man? A pizza pie? They have to, right? No, I, I don't think they do. And I don't think they should make a pizza Pokemon, but they might. It's going to be fire and uh, fairy. It's going to be fire and fairy, dude. And it's going to, first, it's going to be a slice of pizza, right? And then when it evolves, it's going to be the full pie. <laughs> no, it's so stupid, man. <laughs> you know it's going to happen. I shouldn't give them ideas. Yeah. Uh, well, to be fair, you're not delivering the ideas. I don't think they're watching our Pixelmon series. I'll be honest. You're joking, right? Dude, do you remember that series we had called like Legends Arceus or something? The I think we called it like the Legend of Arceus. What, what was our series called, dude? Oh, that is true. We did have a series like three years before the game came out that was called Legends of Arceus. It was called, yeah, Legend of Arceus. That was what the series was called. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah and we it came out in 2000, uh, four years ago. It came out four years ago at this point. Yeah, Jordan. <laughs> Maybe they are listening. <laughs> Maybe they love what we do. Because unfortunately, Jordan, I don't think the Pokemon team does plan their games more than two months ahead. Really? No, it's more than that. But like, they are putting out games at an alarming rate. Dude, they should put out a game that only adds one more Pokemon. Like, that's how many Pokemon they should add every time. Just one. And it should all be different forms of Charizard. Dude, they should sell it for $80. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. By the way, Metapod is evolving. Bro! Oh, do you yeah. Bro, now you're gonna get Butterfly. It's a fly made of butter. It's also very <laughs> yum, dude. 
Yeah. Dude, that could be such a good form for a different region. <laughs> oh, wait a minute, dude. You're so right, though. Yeah, you didn't see that coming. Oh, wait. Yo, I see a I see a Fletchinder somewhere around here. Yes, I've already caught a Fletchling. Yeah, and I was talking about a Tentacool. Do you have that? No, I don't, Jordan. Genius. I, you see, you were talking about a Tentacool, but I thought you were talking about a Fletchinder because what you said was not Tentacool, but maybe it was Fletchinder. Oh, did you did you mishear me and hear Fletchinder? Yo, I did. Oh, sorry. I have an accent and sometimes it sounds like I'm saying Fletchner when I say tentacle. That's true. Oh, that may have been my first critical capture I just got, Jordan. Oh, yo. Hey, wait, I think you get those, dude, based on the Pokemon you catch, dude. So I think us catching them is actually making us better, right? Yes, that is exactly how it works, Jordan. Oh, I see you swimming out there, man. Hello. Hello, Fred. How are you doing over there? Hello. Goodbye, friend. I'm catching a tentacle. Nicholas, guess what? Oh, there's a lot of ocean Pokemon. I'm not ready for a full ocean episode yet, Jordan. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like being in the ocean. We need a turtle helmet first. What do you need, Nicholas? Is you need a um, you need a wetsuit and you need to fuse with a frog like Ash did in that one episode. Mm. Yes. Did he fu did he fuse with a frog? Mario's done that too. Yes, Mario he, he fused with a frog, a tanuki. And now an Elefanto. I don't think that's a spoiler. If Chris Pratt can do it, I can too. If Chris Pratt can do it, can you do it? You know Chris Pratt's Garfield? What? Yeah. Wait, what did you just say to me? He's Garfield now. <laughs> Nicholas, can you say that again? I feel like I'm mishearing you. Monday's lasagna. Wow. He's, he's Garfield? He's Garfield. Anyways, Jordan. Yo. I think this is a good time to go ahead and end off this episode of Pokemon Gotta Catch It All. I have increased the total to 61, and you have caught plenty as well that we will see next time on the games. Woohoo! I gotta sit down for a second, Nick.